Hi there, and welcome to this day in history for October 14th. October 14th is the 287th day of the year in the Gregorian calendar, 288th day in leap years with 78 days remaining to the end of the year. Today's word is ballistic. Ballistic is an adjective that means of or relating to the dynamics of projectiles or the science of the motion of projectiles in flight behaving like a projectile, <laughs> as if a projectile has a will of its own. Sometimes it seems that way. And from those descriptions then also comes to mean extremely and usually suddenly excited, upset, or angry, or wild, as in, she went ballistic. <laughs> ballistic. Yeah, that's mostly, it started out being about projectiles in flight and evolved from there. And now let's get on with this day in history. And we're going to start in 1066 when the Norman conquest of England began with the Battle of Hastings on October 14th, 1066. On October 14th, 1322, Robert the Bruce of Scotland defeated King Edward II of England at the Battle of Old Byland, forcing Edward to accept Scotland's independence. This is the birthday of poet and playwright E.E. E. Cummings, born October 14, 1894. He lived to the age of 67. The Chicago Cubs clinched the 1908 World Series on October 14, 1908. <laughs> defeating the Detroit Tigers 2-0. to zero. This would be their last win of the World Series until 2016. On October 14, 1947, Chuck Yeager became the first person to exceed the speed of sound. This is the birthday of English singer-songwriter and producer Thomas Dolby, born October 14, 1958. He has a pretty good discography and worked a lot with sound. I particularly remember him for a song called She Blinded Me With Science. <laughs> the Cuban Missile Crisis began on October 14, 1962, when an American reconnaissance aircraft took photographs of Soviet ballistic missiles being installed in Cuba. And I'm going to let that be it for us today. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you learned something you didn't know before. I know I sure did. I always do. As always, links to my research are included in the show notes, as is the playlist for my This Day in History series. Give it a like if you enjoyed this video. Consider subscribing if you haven't already. Feel free to share this with others. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time. Is that right? I'm gonna have to look that up. I don't... So what we'll do is we'll just record another one like it and choose the one we like best. That sounds like a pretty ambitious project. Okay, just leave that part out. Not the first day, but the birthday. I guess the birthday is the first day. This is what happens when you don't clean up your script. <laughs> we might leave that part out. <laughs> I don't know how well that's going to go together or if it's even going to make it to the video. We'll just see. That's not going to go. Yeah, we're going to cut those out. And that'll all be laying on the cutting room floor. <laughs> so I'll just do that whole thing over. <laughs> that might not make it into the video. We'll see. Changing it up. <laughs>